In the picturesque setting of Stirling University campus sits the Dementia Services Development Centre. So the Dementia Services Development Centre has been at the University of Stirling for about 20 years. And originally it was in a small part of the university, but about 10 years ago this beautiful building was opened up and we think it's the first ever dementia friendly building that was created in the world and it's a great opportunity to show architects and designers that dementia friendly buildings can actually be very aesthetically pleasing. It's a beautiful building in a lovely setting. Um, here at the Dementia Centre we do a range of things. We do research and teaching and we also provide information to the public and to students and to professionals who are working with people with dementia. Um, everything we do is based on research. We advise people on things that will make a difference and we've also got a library service and a bookshop so that we can spread the information as much as possible as well as through our website. This specially designed building is host to hundreds of architectural and garden design features to help people with dementia with everyday life, as well as solutions for around the home. The centre's dedicated research team works on innovations in care, policy and practice and developing dementia research. The specially designed gardens and features are vital tools in educating people about practical solutions when living with dementia. There are two or three ways in which art is really important for people with dementia. On one level, it's enormous fun to do artistic things, to do sewing or patchwork, uh, to do painting or to take time to do the sorts of things that people maybe haven't had time to do in their lives. People have had great fun doing these things as children but then never done it again. And it's interesting that the research shows that sometimes the disinhibition that comes with dementia that perhaps would have stopped people who were younger taking part in art activities means that they're more inclined to do them when they have dementia. And so people with dementia love singing and they love dancing and they love expressing themselves through art. At the Development Centre, they often have art exhibitions in this bright and welcoming space, including both professional art and art made by people with dementia. Art and Healthcare is delighted to have one of our paintings hanging on their memory wall. People with dementia can appreciate art and there might be something somewhere near you that helps people with dementia appreciate art. That's what we teach people um, to understand. Health and social care workers need to look and see what there is that's available.